I'm Vishnu Subramanian from JavaSlabs.a. Do you know that it's super easy to build and share your AI model using Radio and deploying it in JavaSlabs.a? In this video, I'm going to show how to build a Marvel classifier which predicts your Marvel character. Hopefully, right? It's a toy example. The idea is to show how easy it is to build and deploy. In order to do this, first thing is we need to have a instance so here i have a a5000 running but you can choose any gpu or cpu that you want and you can start it and i have a jupyter lab running which also have this app that's running but let me restart the notebook so we all start from the scratch there are four important things first thing is you install the gradio app the gradio python library and we are going to use fasta for the data pipeline and predict function so we will need a data pipeline to process the data to do any data augmentation or pre-processing that is required and then we need a predict function when we get an image to our application we want to know how to predict uh, whether the given image is a cat or a dog or in this case it's a model character so we use learn.predict from fastai to strike out a lot of concepts and then to build a dashboard we need to use gradio and we use a thing called gradio interface and which takes three primary inputs uh, it takes a lot of things it has a lot of different options but to keep it simple it takes you need a function here we pass the find characters function and you need inputs here in our simple example all we need is just an image and we need outputs we just need to figure out which category the image belongs to and then you have this launch function and if you're doing it in local what you can do is just say demo.launch and you'll have your local version of it available but if you are doing it in javaslabs.a, there are two changes that we would like you to do. One is say that server name is equal to 0.0.0.0. We are basically saying that make this app available in the local network. And we ensure that all the ports are blocked. We only open few ports. And one of the ports is 6006. You can ask Gradio to launch the application on this particular port. Once you run this, let's quickly run this. I've installed Gradio, so I don't need to run this, but in your case, you may have to run. Let's import all the libraries that is required. We need Gradio and FastA. And let's create a data block. And if you want to see the images, we can say dls.showbatch. Okay, let's look at a bunch of images. Okay, I used Kaggle kernel from Jeremy Howard to create this model a slightly modified version more or less the same this is a notebook that i use for training okay let's click this i use this notebook for training the model is it a bird creating a model from your own data one of the amazing things in this notebook is Jeremy how it shows how easy it is to curate your data uh, using this simple fast functions which basically downloads data from so the training part is very simple there's nothing much fancy going on so all i wanted to show you is this deploy function let's let's create a predict function and let's put it as part of the radio once this is done let's wait for a few seconds now let's go back to the javaslabs.a dashboard and right click here on your instance and go to get urls and click on the api endpoint so we can see our app is running we can just uh, upload an image not sure if it predicts it correctly though. Yeah, lucky it predicts it correctly. Right. And you can share this URL with your friends. You can also add authentication and Gradio Gradio support simple password authentication. You can use that. That's it. I'll be uh, really amazed to see what all you can build using this. Build it and want it to be it's in public domain. Uh, tag JavaSlabs.ai. We'll be happy to see what you're doing and if you have any suggestions please leave it in the comments and let us know the chat option or you can talk to me on twitter thank you bye bye